point six two five as a fraction that is decimal as a fraction so to express decimal as a fraction we have to go through three steps right the first step we have to uh, drop this decimal point and and we have to take the number as numerator you know that in fraction we have two part one is numerator or top part and another is de denominator or bottom part so drop the decimal point and make this number the numerator of the fraction so if i drop this number so i am getting here 6 to 5 as my numerator of the fraction then we have to find out the denominator denominator of, of the fraction is the place value of the last digit of the decimal here last digit is 5 here 10 plus then 100th plus then 1000 plus so I have to write here 1000 right look the denominator of the fraction in the the denominator of the fraction is the place value of the last digit of the decimal this is 1000th plus so this is our fraction and at last we have to reduce this fraction to the lowest term here is the another way to express this decimal as fraction look for first drop this decimal point and write the number and for denominator for decimal you have to write one and for each digit after decimal you have to write zero for six zero then for two zero for five zero so we are getting thousand right for decimal you have to consider one and for all the digit after decimal you have to add just zero 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 right so now look we have to reduce this fraction here 625 we can express or split this number as a product of two number here unit digit is 5 so this is divisible by 5 so let us do that 625 it is divisible by 5 so 5 goes into 6 1 times 5 if you subtract 1 these two will come here 5 goes into 12 2 times 2 times 5 10 subtract 2 okay put down 5 5 goes into 25 5 times so 5 times 25 5 times 125 equal to 625 right if you multiply the divisor and quotient you will get the dividend right so this is 1000 so if you divide this 1000 you will get 100 plus 10 equal to 1000 right so here we have 5 so we can split this 10 as 5 so let us uh, split this 10 as 5 times 2 that gives us 10 so this 5 this 5 cancel each other right so we are getting here look 125 divided by 100 times 2 so this is the number where unit digit is 5 so this is also divisible by 5 so let us divide this number by 5 so 5 goes into 12 2 times 2 times 5 10 if you subtract then 2 this 5 will come here 5 goes into 25 5 times so 5 times 5 25 0 that is you can express this 125 as 5 times 25 and here you can express this 100 like this 10 times 10 right so here we have 5 so you can uh, write you can write this 10 as 5 times 2 right so this 5 this 5 cancel each other so we are getting here 25 over 2 times 10 times 2 
so we can write 25 as 5 times 5 and we can express this 10 as 5 times 2 right so now look now we, we will cancel this 5 and this 5 so we are getting here 5 divided by 2 times 2 times 2 that is look 5 divided by 2 times 2 4 4 times 2 8 5 divided by 8 is the answer right you will not you can't uh, simplify this uh, fraction so this is the lowest fraction 5 divided by 8 so 0.625 as a fraction is 5 divided by 8